right, what is going on? Welcome to the channel. All right, another FSD beta video for you all here today. We are here in Washington, D.C. We are doing a little drive through, about to get onto the Navy Yard Bridge. Oh, wow, look how FSD responded to this car. Wow, what a interesting situation there. That car just camped out, FSD decided to almost let him in and then proceeded but wow oh, um it's, it's nice to see the way it reacted here we go taking the exit all right we're officially on the navy yard bridge entering into washington dc gonna give you a little bit of a fsd drive here on 695 and we should be kind of merging onto 395 take a look at the way it handled all of those lane changes and we got a pretty sharp turn coming up here fsd doing its thing handling these turns really nicely all right so here we go making another lane change deciding to get out to follow the route since uh we gotta merge on to 395 all right so we got dc in its uh glory right ahead of us hard to see with the capital off to our right monuments straight ahead the wharf off to our left um so we can get a real good glimpse of how FSD acts. So we're going to do a takeover here since we noticed the cop pulling out there and FSD trying to change lanes at the same time. So just, you know, trying to think ahead there and, you know, knowing FSD may not recognize the cop pulled over. So, all right, so... FSD doing its thing in the rain, driving through DC, such a great view over here, um, Capitol building right behind us to the right, and FSD is really driving really well down this road, um, I have to say. That was me with the wipers, actually. I'm not sure why it didn't click on automatically. Well, I don't have it on. Actually, I do have it on auto. Now, with this new update, you can take it off auto if you decide to. But I really like the way the computer handled that part of the drive. Um, very spectacular. No takeovers there other than the cop situation where I didn't have to take over, but I just thought it would have been the smarter move. Um, so I just decided to. I always think when in doubt, take over. Um, I saw the cop indicating, so I just went ahead and you know made sure that FSD didn't just abruptly get in this way. All right, so the Wharf Marina, we are passing officially underneath us to the left. Um, officially making our way into Virginia. So, should be able to see Roslyn coming up here soon. But it is a pretty cloudy day. Jefferson Memorial up there. Roslyn Bar. FSD with a nice lane switch. Crystal City straight ahead. That's where Amazon's building their new headquarters. Or have built, I don't even know. But it's supposed to be. All right, FSD really just handling the flow of traffic really good. Um, I'm feeling the, the confidence that the computer is displaying um, because it's handling these situations really well. The car is weaving in and out of traffic um, with, its, with the car also weaving in and out of traffic. It's, it's, it's able to really adapt to the dynamics of the road really well. All right, so here we go, getting onto the 395 bridge, officially over the Potomac River. A lot of traffic out today. Not too much, but you know how people drive in the rain makes you feel that way. All right, so. Once we cross this bridge, 
Bridge. We are officially in Arlington, Virginia. Um, as you can see, we are constantly cutting through DC, Maryland, and Virginia. Uh, here in the DMV area, we're kind of like a tri-state area. You can drive, you know, 10 miles and be in all three. And uh, yeah, all three has a lot to offer. I think each place is pretty uh, special in its own way. Um, yeah, so shout out to, the, to all the locals out here in the DMV. Uh, really liking to see all the Tesla adoption, but I am starting to see wait times now at the Tesla chargers here in the DMV area, which is a first. When I got this car back in the end of 2021, this, um, there, there's actually more chargers than there was back then, but um, I was like the only one at the chargers, seriously, and like it's crazy now there's like no spots available. All right, here we are. This is the Pentagon. We are actually cutting through the Pentagon parking lot, which is like a, a regular way we take here in Arlington. But yeah, most secure building in the world right there. Very cool. We drive by it like every day. And that is the Air Force Memorial. A lot of cool sights to see when you're driving through DC. Um, something that I try not to take for granted because I'm a local, but there's always so much going on over here, as well as so much construction. As you see, they're constantly building. Um, and it's, it's pretty amazing to see. Arlington has just pretty much run out of space too, the way that everything has come up around here. Really nice job about taking the exit. Another thing FSD is so great about is just, you know, keeping you in the right lane so you don't miss your exit. Um, and if you know in this area, if you take one wrong turn, they can add like 20, 30 minutes to your commute. So having FSD really helps. They try to make it as easy as possible. So if, when you're driving, you just have to quickly glance down. You can see that, hey, in 0.6 miles, I gotta shift over to my right lane to get on the second street. Um, and then coming up from there, I've got an, a left turn in 0.7 miles from there. So here it's already alerting me to get into my far right lane. So FSD will do that as well because um, it's programmed too. So this is going to be a super sharp exit as well as the conclusion to the video here. So let's see how we do with um, the stability handling this and uh, overall getting off the highway. Definitely want to thank everyone for watching this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Uh, make sure you hit that like button. Here we go. Um, this is going to be a super sharp exit here. And here we go. FSD getting down to 22. That's the Fort Myers base right there. As you can see, we've got a lot going on here in Arlington, right really close to the Arlington Cemetery. We just passed that as well too. All right, so here we are, officially made it. I want to thank everyone for watching this. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Hit that like button if you did, and I hope you have a great rest of your day.